some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Harvey, Illinois with, uh, well, one of the biggest morons in the uh, frauditing game, Tyrant Terminator Audits. And in this video, he finds himself getting trespassed from the Department of Children and Families. And you know what? Even I find this uh, bit of uh, stupidity on his part quite embarrassing. I mean, it is just a, well, real S show all the way around. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Yo, what's good, TTA family? Back at y'all with another one. Man, today we at the Illinois Department of Children and Family Services out in Harvey, Illinois. We just getting ready to see they respect our rights to record in public and to make sure that our rights are not infringed on by anyone at any time. Hey, dumbass, I got a question for you. What about the rights of uh, the people in that building? Do you care anything about their rights? I mean, especially the parents that go in there uh, when they don't want their children filmed by morons like you. I mean, there's already been a bunch of controversy lately about some other moron who walked into a WIC office and started filming children here recently. But you know what? I understand. It's uh, always with you guys. Rights for me, but not for thee. I mean, yeah, I understand. You you don't want anybody else to have rights because you want to be the people in power. Because you know what? I completely understand that now. Because recently a frauditor, another frauditor, actually told me to my face that I did not have the right to own a YouTube channel because I am a government worker. So that just goes to show you the mindset of what these frauditors are. Yeah. Boring! Yeah, I agree, Homer. So let's just go ahead and fast forward through this dead air, shall we? That's much too early. Prepare to fast forward. Preparing to fast forward. Fast forward. Fast forwarding, sir. Two things I'm here to do. Uh, first thing I want to do is uh, be able to exercise our rights to record in public. And the second, uh, not interested. Okay. So here's the sign. And yes, of course, the sign that pretty much talks about the privacy of others will be respected within this a uh, limited public forum. But you know what? This frauditor doesn't really care about signs. I mean, I mean, no sign is lawful. I mean, according to a lot of frauditors, if there's no statute on a sign, then it's not exactly lawful, including a stop sign. So, yeah, uh, don't stop at that uh, four-way stop when you get to that intersection and see what happens. Because, after all, according to their logic, that sign is not exactly lawful because there was no statute on it, so you're good to go. And to hell with protecting the confidentiality of uh, the patrons of this office. Yeah, to hell with them. It's all about the rights of the cameraman. Huh? Oh, it's all good. Yeah, she's... She came out like she wanted to know and then just walked away, so. Yeah, it's all good. I appreciate that, too. <laughs> so, yeah, the security said. I can't hear you. Yeah, I, I see the sign, but that's just a sign. If you want to uh, maybe contact the supervisor or somebody, maybe they'll let you know that we can record, so. How you doing today, ma'am? Right. What, what Are you like a supervisor? I want to, uh, who do you want to speak to? Well, she was saying something. I, 
you know, about a sign about not recording, but I was trying to tell her that that's just a sign that doesn't, you know, it doesn't really have any force of uh, law. So, you know, it's just a sign. Oh, she's calling to the Oh, okay. And there you go. The frauditor's flawed logic shines through once again. Like I said, a sign has no meaning to it unless it's enforceable by a law, and it must have a statute on it according to the frauditor. Uh, a shame that's, that that really doesn't work in the real world. Just try that out on the streets with a cop whenever you say there was no uh, statute on that stop sign saying that you had to stop. Yeah, and uh, I'm sure the uh, judge will laugh at you all the way to uh, jail. A little longer than a few minutes later. Hi, sir. How are you? All right. How are you doing today, ma'am? Well, are you videotaping? Yes, ma'am. So, like I was trying to tell the lady behind the desk when she first came out, she said, what are you mm -hmm. doing? I was trying to let her know that I'm here to do two things. The mm -hmm. first thing is we want to exercise our right to record just in public. Mm -hmm. And the second thing I need to do is file a FOIA, which is an additional right as well. Mm -hmm. So she wasn't interested in hearing the second thing. So. Okay. Well, I get you, but where's our sign up here? Because there's somewhere that says we can't record. So I get what you're trying to do, uh -huh. but we can't allow recording inside here because of the nature of the, the children and that we deal with. Yeah, so I, can I, can, you, I can understand. Can you please stop recording? Yeah, can you speak, uh, please? Yeah. You and I can speak. I don't. I, I can understand what you're saying, ma'am, and I understand your position. But the thing is about the sign. The sign has no force of law. It's just a sign. But it's, it's, it's this is this is not uh, public property. It is because so it, it's, it's uh, Illinois state. It is, but in, oh. inside of here, sir, uh. I'm saying, but we we're asking that you don't record. I understand. You have a conversation. I understand you guys are asking. I'm mm -hmm. just saying respectfully, I have a right. I have a right so, to do but it. But if you want to request a FOIA, this is not the place to do it. This is not our main office. Yeah, I know. So what? What? So how FOIA goes? I can oh, fill the FOIA out of any public oh, entity. Do you have it? We don't have it here. So no, no. I fill it out on a blank sheet and yeah. turn it in that way. That's okay. that's the law. Okay. So I get you, so because we have people, our kids are not supposed to be recorded. So that's what we're asking you not to do that. Yeah, for sure. So intentionally, I'm not trying to record any kids or anything like that. Oh, you weren't intentionally trying to record children. Uh, dude, I just had to blur out uh, some children on your video as they walked in, you moron. So if you were really concerned about filming children, then why didn't you do that? Why didn't you take the few seconds that it took me to blur out that uh, group of children that was on your video. And uh, what about the other children that might appear on your video? What about them? Are you concerned about their well-being as well? Uh, no, no, it's not. that's not it. Uh, no, you're just more concerned about rights for me and not for thee? Oh, yeah, I understand. You're, uh, you're an emotionless frauditor who doesn't care about anybody but himself. I mean, yeah, I understand. Oh, by the way, since you obviously did film these children, I'm sure that uh, there'll be a lot of people that would uh, be more than happy to, uh, well, uh, report your channel for, uh, well, filming children without their parents' permission, especially since it's against YouTube policy and essentially against the law. Still, you see people coming in and out. I definitely try my best to not get the kids. Bullshit! Bullshit! Okay. If I can just. Can you just call. Um, as you make a phone call, let me just talk to you. Okay. I get you, sir. I'm just. I've asked. That's okay. all I can do is ask. Okay. So. Five minutes later. Sir. Sir. Can you please tell me that this is fire? Side, what, gonna, this is public I, I records it, as well, is, right? This is, there's nothing public here, sir. I'm just asking you not there's to. Not, that's, so this right I'm, here is so, not for the public? So, so I'm asking you not to record. We ask you not videotaping. It's not allowed. Well, respectfully, so, ma'am, are you are you I, contacting the higher up, like someone over you that may know about our rights? Because that'll be I, great. I, I'm calling the police. That's what I'm, oh, I'm asking. Well, I think that's unnecessary. I, it may be unnecessary to you, sir, but I'm actually, we asked you to leave the building. That's what the policy says. It's right there on the wall. I showed it. To, we talked about it, but. I can understand, but right. the policy the policy is not law. So. I, I I get you. Okay. I get you, so that's fine. Okay. So yeah, we're just trying to get the evacuation. Okay, thank you. Plan zone right there. She didn't want us to record, but it's not 
I know what I want. I don't want you to record period because that's what the pop, that's what it says on the wall out here. I'm not saying this I can understand what you're saying, but but you you understand that we do have I, rights, I get, right? I get oh. your rights. So you even say, though you understand the rights, you're going to try to trample them. I'm, I'm not going to trample them, so I'm going to repeat to you what's all, what's out here stating that there's no video recording in our building. That's what I'm saying. That's even though I'm even though we have a right to do I'm it, I'm not going to talk about your rights. Oh, okay. Well, but you but that's where it comes down to. I'm going to enforce what we have here. This is what we have. Okay. Can't talk about your rights. I'm not talking about your rights. I'm talking oh, okay. about the rights of the children, the families we serve, and they have a right not to be videotaped or being here and to be. This should not be happening here. Okay. It should not be happening. At that all. That just don't make sense if you do it, definitely it, and it, stand or understand it, our rights and and you're trying to disregard them. So that's kind of. Uh, dude, you have no idea what your rights are anyway. You just uh, parrot whatever the other frauditors say all the time. You're not exactly the most intelligent one in the lot, and I will prove that later on with uh, something that you say. And it is going to be a beautifully stupid comment out of your mouth. So I want you guys to prepare for that because it is going to be hilariously Stupid. Even more so than everything he's already said at this point. That's, uh, you can put words in my mouth, sir. That's not what I said. No, well, you actually did say you do understand our rights. Calling the police I said, is... I understand you have rights. I didn't say your rights in regards to what you're doing. I said we, we have a right to post what we need to, and it says that you're not supposed to be videotaping, and that's what I asked you to stop and to please leave the building. But you're not doing that, so I'm doing what we need to do, which is call the police. Oh, well, I think that's... Call them? Definitely not necessary. I mean, to subject someone to harm, mm -hmm. possible harm for exercising the right. So uh, that's that's definitely not um, fair. Who's that? So mm -hmm. she definitely said she's called Harvey Police. So we just mm -hmm. wait for Harvey Police to get here. And, so let's just go ahead and skip uh, to uh, the point where the cops show up because, you know, he's not really going to get anything out of this except a trespass. So let's roll that beautiful bean footage, shall we? Many, many minutes later. How you doing, officer? Good morning, sir. Good morning. Uh, officer Adams. Officer Adams, appreciate that. Uh, appreciate that, sir. So, uh... Like I was just explaining yeah, to that yeah, young man, it seems like he understood the other personnel guy that was just standing right there. Uh, is I need to do two things while I'm here. The first thing we need to do is uh, be able to record in public and ex exercise our First Amendment right. That's the first thing. The second thing is I need to file a FOIA, which is an additional right. Uh, I tried to explain that to this young lady and the lady that's on the phone that obviously called you guys. and They're not interested in our rights today. So. Who is our right? I'm sorry. I, our you meaning, me meaning we the people. Did you tell me who you are? No, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. You didn't. What's your name, sir? I, I just want to remain anonymous, Officer Adams. But I told you my name. Well, you are required, respectfully. But that's not. <laughs> that's not just. I didn't say fair. That's not just. Just. Because I have a right to tell you who I am. You as well on a public way in regards to me knowing who you are and who I'm talking to. I just asked for your name. I, I understand, but I'm just saying. Name, res last name. Okay, you respectfully, I was just saying. Me, yeah, just right. respectfully, uh, Officer Adams. So why are you here? Uh, okay, again, so we want to be able to exercise our rights to record in public. Who is we? We the people. We the people. We the people? Uh, yeah, yeah. You don't exactly represent me. I don't care about filming inside of a government building for any reason whatsoever. I mean, if you want to go film to your heart's content outside and just uh, annoy people out on the streets, by all means, just go ahead and do that all you want. But the moment that you start acting like uh, king shit of everything... That's when we have a problem because the, you're just another little person out there who thinks he's bigger than him. Well, he actually is. You are just some pathetic low-life criminal who found a gig on YouTube that uh, actually pays you to be an asshole toward everybody that you encounter. And sometimes you get arrested for it, but hey, it's a payday in the end for you, huh? I mean, that's all it comes down to. And if you trample on the rights of everybody else to get there, well, so much the better. I mean, it rights for me, not for thee. Am I right? 
I mean, that is the fraud of the mantra, isn't it? I'm um, rights for me, not for thee. I mean, that's what you pretty much uh, your mission statement is. And the second thing is we want to be able to follow for you. So both of those are rights. They're, they're not privileges. They are absolutely rights that are guaranteed by the Constitution. No. Oh, really? Uh, you say it's a, uh, an amendment to the Constitution or something like that? Because, well, I've looked in the Constitution and there is nothing in there about FOIA. But if you look at the laws, which are outside of the U.S. Constitution, yeah, you'll find it there. So it's not in the Constitution. It was just written as a law, you freaking moron. You don't get that done, then what? You gonna remain here? Well, well, I'm definitely gonna get it done. I'm definitely gonna get it done. I've actually, it's fairly small in here, so I've already got as much as I can get. if I sit down? Oh, of course not, I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do. If you don't get it done, then what are you going to do? No, I'm going to get it done. Remain here? I'm going to get it done. Now. How are you going to get it done? You know what a FOIA is, correct? Yes, sir. So I need to file Here's a FOIA. Information at. That's correct. So if I'll file a FOIA. If you don't get it done, what are you going to do? If you don't get it done today, what are you going to do? I'm definitely going to. I don't understand the question because I'm going to get it done. That's why I'm here. <laughs> How are you going to get it done if they don't allow you to do it? And if there's a procedure other mm -hmm. than you doing it right here? Then what, sir? So uh, how it works is if they don't, like, give me a FOIA form to fill out, I'll fill it out on a blank sheet, and that should suffice because the state of Illinois, there's no standard form even. And if it doesn't... Well, the state of Illinois has no standard form. Well, let me ask you something. Does the Department of Children and Families uh, for the state of Illinois have a standard form? Uh, because, well, if you look on their website, yes... They do have a form you can fill out on there, and they request that you send it to a particular person. So, dude, you're pretty much barking up the wrong freaking tree at this point. So they do have a procedure. You're just choosing to ignore it. Or the more likely thing is you just haven't done any research on anything about FOIAs at all. And I'm willing to bet that's the issue that you have not done any research. Suffice, then what will you do then? Well, the only way- you continue to remain here? Um, I mean, I'm definitely gonna not let my rights, I'm not gonna allow my rights to be trampled on at all. Okay. At all. Have so, I trampled on your rights within the past five minutes since I've been here? No, of all course right. not. So, so we just, not but they have, <laughs> they right. have. So now, if you're not able to accomplish what you said you want to do, mm -hmm. then what are you going to do? I will, we'll just file some complaints. We got to do it anyway. We have right. to file some complaints on so this have entity. you made an attempt to try to file a Freedom on Act information? Not at this point. Okay. Not yet. What else are you planning on doing? That's the only, there's no two things. So recording public is the first one. And the second one is the file for you. Okay. Which we now, do recognize that those are rights, right, Officer Adams? Now you know. Do you concur? They are, but there are okay. guidelines to every human right. Okay. There are guidelines to every human right. Okay. And now you're in a facility That's correct. that they have posted to where you have confidentiality. Not you in have public. A right. It's not the public. This DCFS, this is a building dealing with children. So it is so it's a state agency. This, this, this is a building that deals with children. What's your name, That officer? I protect the kill. I'll this, secure. Okay, yeah. This is a building that deals with kids which oh, means they have right. the right to safeguard the children and that's what they're doing at this point that's correct okay. but we, and we also have a right to film in public sir okay fine did you film already uh okay you can't was, go back there because the kids are back that's there. A, absolutely we we'll never try to go to restricted areas sir. okay all so right. to just de-escalate so, so can killing. we do this sir you're getting kind of can, can we step you know. outside and talk about this so they can do what they have to do for these kids and then you can go do your four years and all the things. I got to do my four year right here. here. Yeah, I got to do my four year. I don't know if they have. Well, you, I don't know if they have a four year for here. They might. They might. We haven't. We haven't asked them yet. Do you have a four year for this facility for for DC? No, he said he can print it down. Okay, so yeah, you yeah, so, go online. Go no, sir. Go. No, sir. I can fill it out on the blank sheet. Okay, yeah. Listen, they don't have a four year at this location, sir. That's they okay if they don't. I can fill it out on a blank sheet. Sir. Okay, sir. Can you please just step outside with us? Sir, I have so, to, so I have, that, I have so to file my FOIA okay. and I have to exercise my rights. Well, you got to file a FOIA right is what I'm asking. Here, sir. I just told they you. They said they don't have it. So, so did you hear me say a blank sheet? Okay, so we, but okay, but you can't fill a blank sheet out of here. Yes, you can, sir. Kids. That's the law, sir. They've got stuff to do. What do you? What, There's no kids even here. <laughs> you on medication or something? 
Sir, that's, that's, not, 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 that's, not, that's disgusting for you to go there. Are you on medication? Why? Because I'm exercising my right? No, she's letting you know there are children here. I'm saying, what does the medication have to do that with you? I'm exercising That means if you, we may have to call and get you an a, 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 a ambulance. Get you I don't need an ambulance, medical, sir. Please. I need a, I need to exercise my rights okay, without you guys trying to step on them. That's not your rights. This, the young lady explained to you, sir, that they don't have that here. And that's correct. Children present, that's correct. So I can fill it out on the blank sheet. This was just all I want to know. Is you guys going to aid them in trying to violate my rights? That's all I need to know. When you fill it out on a blank sheet. That's correct. What do you want personnel to do with that blank sheet? All they will have to do by law is forward it to their public information officer. To do what? What is your plan? FOIA is for me to request materials, officer. What's What's materials? Materials? I'm going to ask for general, general information. Sir, sir, you need to de-escalate. Here go your blank piece of paper. Go ahead and write it out. You need to so de-escalate, man. Because he's, he's trying to escalate the situation, sir. Here you go, sir. I'm, go I'm going to, but I don't need to be rushed. Okay, sir. Here you go, pen. Okay, you so can set we, it there. So they can deal with what they got to do with Okay, you can set it there. Okay, there you go. There you go. It'll be general information. Okay. Yeah. General. Yeah. Just general information about this entity. Just general information, nothing specific, like uh, cases or anything like that, because, well, if you're just looking for general information that's easily available, all you have to do is ask. You don't need a damn FOIA re request. So at this point, dude, uh, you're just being an asshole. And at this point, I'm getting tired of hearing his mouth, so I'm just going to skip ahead a few minutes at the point where he does get trespassed. So let's roll that beautiful bean footage. Five minutes later. You can't remain here in the manner that you are. As my partner explained to you, you can't have that device going on here. And that, it's a public place in regards to those who have business to attend to. Now, if you're okay. outside, sir, you're more than welcome to record whatever you may choose. And, but and, you're coming in here, we're dealing with children, babies, we're dealing with adults, we're dealing with family members. Okay. Confidentiality. Ma'am, I'm sorry, who are you? I'm Robin Albert, and I'm on the administrator's senior leadership. Yes, ma'am. Officer Adams in the Harvey Police Department. Okay. Can you please try to help this matter understandable in regards to letting this person know the confidentiality? I do videotape for now. Yes, ma'am. I do not. I refuse Excuse to be videotaped. I understand. So uh, we have a right to do it. I've been trying to tell everybody here that we have a First Amendment right to do so, and I also have a right to file a FOIA. So we hope that that doesn't be infringed on. Why is this established here? Well, we have youth here that cannot be videotaped without proper consent yes, from the guardian. Um, their uh, confidentiality cannot be breached. They are identified known to the public, yes, unless uh, the guardian consents to that. Yes, so that's one of the reasons. But also, this is state property. Yes, which makes it public property. That's correct. And we, ahead, um, as you see, have. Um, Acts that people not videotape to, to ensure that we're not reaching anyone's confidentiality. How about outside the building? What about that? This is um, public property um, outside, but not any people going in and out of the building. Within side of the building. Right. So it's a little different type of uh, establishment when you're outside of this building. That's Even true. on the state property, you can take pictures, videotape, so forth and so on. I don't see where that's prohibited, but I once see. again, we do have youth and care coming in and out of this building, so the staff have not consented to their videotape. So that's against the law. And what is it that you would like this person to do that's standing dressed in a cap? Yeah, what's wrong with that? Shirt, yeah, what's wrong with that? I'm just my way of identifying you. Since oh, okay. I don't know who you are. Well, I'm, you, you're, you're definitely, definitely going to find out who I am. Okay, so you've been found. Yeah. All right. Okay, so ma'am, can you please look at him and tell him that you would I'd like them to leave the premises? Sir, I'm asking that you leave the premises. Okay, and you're the manager? Excuse me, ma'am. Yes, I'm on Okay, so I can't file my FOIA today. What's the procedure for filing that? Just got to make sure we get all Can this you clear documented. The doors so they can For come sure. Out, Just, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. For so sure. We don't have, like I said before, yes, I'm one of the managers as well, and we do not have the form here, and he said he can print it down. So That's correct. gave him a piece of paper to do it, but he has not done so. I said what? that he could do it originally, but right. we don't right. have anything. But now you guys can leave, right, so. correct? Yes. Okay. And if I don't leave, I'll be arrested. Correct. Okay, great. That's all I need. That's all we need. So. And here in a moment, we shall soon see. 
uh, the lowest point of stupidity in this video for this uh, particular moron. Uh, that's all we will need, TTA family. Uh, we see that uh, officer officer kill. That's what. That, hey, that's crazy that his name is that, right? Even though they spell it K E E L. <laughs> but his name is Officer Kill. You can tell this dude is biting his lip. And wow, dude, uh, I think you just hit one of the lo lowest rungs of stupidity out there. I mean, uh, yeah, uh, you mispronouncing his name uh, and misunderstanding his uh, last name completely is just quite the lowest form of stupidity. Yeah, it's uh, not spelled K I L L, which would be kill. It is spelled K-E-E-L, and you don't sp uh, pronounce it as kill in that way. You pronounce it as keel. And with that regard, uh, keel is not exactly what you think it is, you blooming idiot. Keel represents the bottom of a ship with a foundation of which a ship starts. You freaking moron. So not only did you fail to understand what FOIA laws are all about, I'm assuming that you don't do any research at all on that point, but you completely uh, blew that whole uh, keel thing. I mean, come on now, dude. You are now the contender for dumbest frauditor of all time. Uh, congratulations, dude. That was a hard-won victory, but you managed to pull it off. Now, will somebody dethrone you? I don't know, but time will tell. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. You don't want to go to jail. For what? You read this. Yeah. I don't have to listen to anything. Thing. Blah, 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 blah. I'm not listening, Josh. I'm not. No, I'm sexual oriented protection. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. You suck. They think they know it all. What's the Third Amendment, punk? Tell me the Third Amendment and I'll leave. What's the Third Amendment? What's the Third Amendment and I'll fing leave right now? What's the Third Amendment? Tell me. What's the Third Amendment? Most definitely. Because you don't understand why I'm here with a camera doesn't mean I have to get out of here. Doesn't mean I have to leave. Doesn't mean I have to go. <clears throat> that sort of thing. Well, this is what we're going to do. Um, we're going to have to enforce the, the CT and have you leave the property. Um, per the postmaster, per the lead, uh, per the, um, the, uh, the person, the landlord of this uh, facility. Uh, so with that said, um, I've got too many entities I know. You gave me a warning to get off the property. I got off the property. I need your name and date of birth. No, sir. You're either going to provide or you're going to jail. I'm going to remain silent, sir. Okay. You want my name and date of birth? Put your hands right now. He chose poorly. Morning, Deputy Regan St. John's County Sheriff's Office. Two reasons I'm stopping you. One, Pine Island speed limit's 25. You're going 36. Okay. That's still 10 miles per hour over the posted speed limit. It's 25. No, it's not 25? So, I was going at 35. Also. So, that's 10 over. You just told me that you're going 10 over the posted speed limit. Oh, no, I didn't tell it, you Yes, you did. You said you're going 35, right? Yeah, but I said... That's a 25. No, ma'am. It's it. The whole thing's 25. Okay. The other issue is your license plate cover is illegal. You can't have a tinted license plate cover over your license plate. How are you? Okay, I'm doing good. Well, you're detained right now. You're not free to leave, okay? Still, Why? I've been calling after you. You know you're not to be on campus. No. You put the phone down. She yes. asked me to leave and I left. No, ma'am. So you, you guys... You are now under arrest. You guys are arresting me for nothing. No. You know you've been arrested for this before. Dumbass! You dumbass! You're a dumbass. Such a dumbass. You're an ass.
Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's... Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that? You know why you're kicking me out? Because you don't want wa someone watching a movie in the courthouse. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I know some of y'all are disappointed. I'm disappointed. Um, I hope that you will continue to watch this channel because this channel has brought more good than negativity.